Hi, my name is Miguel from avoiderrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to migrate from an old PC to a new PC. I'll be migrating all compatible applications, pictures, videos, and documents, among other things. Now, I'm currently using Windows 7, and I'll be migrating to my Windows 10 here to the right. For this tutorial, I'm using Laplink PC Mover Professional. You can find the link in the description box below. This program is not free. You should also install the program on both computers, the old one and the new one. Once installed, go ahead and run it. Now, I can use a program on either computer. So I'm going to use a program on the Windows 10 computer, which is the new one. I'm going to go ahead and click on transfer between PCs. And it'll tell you what I just said. Run PC Mover on both PCs. Click on next. And here it'll find <clears throat> the old PC and new. Okay, so it found the old PC and the new PC. Now, I purposely rename the PCs and the arrow is pointing to the correct direction from the old to the new PC. Now, if it's the opposite way, you can always switch, tra uh, switch the transfer. If you want to know the name of the PC, in case you don't, in Windows 10, just right click the Windows icon and click on System. And here you'll find the PC name. In Windows 7, right click Computer and click on Properties. And you'll find the PC name under Computer Name. Once I click on Analyze PC, it will start checking for all the compatible applications, pictures, documents, videos, etc. Now, I would recommend you close all applications and leave only Laplink PC Mover running. Click on Next. It will calculate the transfer and it'll tell you the amount of data that it needs to transfer and how long it's going to take for that transfer. As you can see here, a total of 1.7 gig, it'll take about a minute to transfer. By clicking on Start Transfer, this will automatically transfer all compatible applications, all pictures, all movies, music, videos, and documents. So I'm going to go ahead and click on Start Transfer. Before you click on OK, make sure both computers are always on throughout the uh, transfer process and click on OK. OK, done. Once I click on Finish, it'll uh, restart and apply my changes. So I'm going to go ahead and click on Finish. I'll be back in a second. Okay, now I noticed that it brought everything, including the desktop wallpaper. Well, actually, it brought, like I said before, compatible applications. If I go to pictures here, I should see the same pictures from my old in the new it should have a copy of everything yep that's awesome well thank you for watching this video my name is Miguel if you have any questions feel free to post them in the comment section below thank you